All right, what's going on, you guys? Nick here with Nick Shine the Power. So I'm going to make a video today about a very fascinating bodybuilder from the 1970s that would go on to pursue a very successful career in acting. So this guy's name was Roger Callard. Now, this guy was the training partner of Arnold Schwarzenegger throughout the 70s. Um, and as a result, Arnold would end up giving him a lot of uh, pretty decent film roles um, in some of Arnold's movies. So Roger pursued bodybuilding for about 10 years. Um, some of his best accomplishments were the Mr. USA, the Mr. America, and the Mr. International title. So as a bodybuilder, Roger's competitive weight was between 185 and 195 pounds on stage, or between 83.9 and 88.5 kilograms. Now, Roger was well known for having the mustache on stage. Obviously, in the 70s, there were quite a few bodybuilders with that mustache. Um, but the mustache was one of his calling cards and one of the things a lot of people recognized him for. Um, he was 5'10", or 177.5 centimeters tall. He is still alive today, and he is currently 67 years of age. So if we go into Roger's full list of competitive accomplishments, he won the 1978 Mr. International, the 1977 Mr. America, the 1976 Mr. Western America, the 1975 Mr. USA, and the 1974 Mr. Western America. Also noteworthy is the fact that he placed within the top three of every competition he competed in um, during his competitive career except for the 1984 IFBB World Pro where he placed 13th, and that was obviously well after his prime, um, his first competition being in 74. So 84 was 10 years later, um, so he was probably right at the end of his competitive career. Um, but this impressive list of accomplishments is really what got him and Arnold um, started training together and began their business relationship in acting. Um, so Roger Callard was also in Pumping Iron. Obviously, a lot of you know what that movie is. It was a docudrama about bodybuilding um, following Arnold Schwarzenegger and Lou Ferrigno's journey up into the Olympia competition. So obviously, Roger was a fixture out there in Venice Beach, uh, training at Gold's Gym with Arnold and the other classic bodybuilders from the 1970s. But his acting career was just as impressive as his bodybuilding career. So I'll go, I'll go through some of his more interesting uh, filmography here. So he was obviously in Pumping Iron. He was in the movie Stay Hungry. Um, he was in the TV show Charlie's Angels. I actually remember that where he was in the Mr. Galaxy um, competition in that show. He was in Red Heat. He was in the movie Twins. That was another Arnold movie. And he's also been in a handful of other like TV movies, TV shows, a lot of smaller stuff. And more recently, he was in the movie Foxcatcher um, from 2014, which had Steve Carell and, of course, uh, Channing Tatum both in that movie. So overall, I think Roger had a very impressive physique. Obviously, he was a lot smaller than Arnold, uh, almost 50 pounds smaller in some cases. But he did have a very impressive physique. He was a lot shorter, a lot less heavy. Um, but he was very conditioned. Um, he had a very good overall balance and symmetry to his physique. You can see some photos of him next to the great Mike Menser, um, where he still looks pretty impressive, even next to Mike. Um, and Mike is arguably one of the greatest bodybuilders of all time to come out of the 1970s. Um, so Roger Callard, overall very impressive bodybuilder. He was able to achieve a very impressive career in acting as well. Um, in my opinion, he's kind of like an Arnold Schwarzenegger in the sense that he was able to really dominate the sport of bodybuilding. And you could kind of make an argument that he somewhat dominated acting, um, you know, really for a bodybuilder. He did pretty good because most bodybuilders get a lot of uh, just really short-lived acting careers, a lot of B-roll type of footage, um, whether they're just like a bodyguard or a background guy. Uh, but Roger had a pretty decent filmography. So that's it for the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Nick Strength and Power, signing out.